It's culture's job to make execution better. It's not culture's job to make sure everybody feels good. What moves people to action is emotion. Keep that in mind. We ha if we want to move people to action and we want to move people to standards, we've, one, we've got to get them moving. What gets them moving is emotion every time. And if it's not emotion that we are helping put around them, then it's emotion that they are providing for themselves. Then what we have to do is we've got to help them figure out how do we create inside of the individual the emotion that moves who? That individual, because not the same emotion moves every single person. In the same way in this room, different emotion moves different one of you. Some of you are motivated by championships. You'll go to the far end. Some of you are just motivated by serving kids. The championship isn't really a concern. Different emotions triggering different actions. We've got to figure out how do we blend the emotional and the rational to create this. Then the question is, what is it that drives action? What is it that drives behavior in a team, in a school, in a group? And it's culture. Culture is probably the most overused and misunderstood word in teams and organizations here today. Uh, I saw a clip I saw a clip not long ago of, I don't know, it was like four minutes of coaches' press conferences, and all it was was three second sound bites of every coach in that offseason who had said, we gotta change the culture. Really gotta re-engineer re the culture. It's just become part of the me too statement of, you get up, you get hired, and say, oh, we gotta change the culture. And I think most of the time we don't even know what we're talking about. I think half the time we think it's, you know, hugs and trust falls, which it isn't, right? We're not doing that until three o'clock. Just kidding. You can hug it if you want, just do it on your own time. No, culture is about, and this is where I want to spend a bunch of time today, culture is about driving a belief system, a shared belief system that drives a very specific kind of behavior that both produces results and creates an experience other people want to be around. And this is the hardest part about culture in my observation. In my observation, the hardest part about culture is that we've misunderstood the purpose of culture, why culture exists. Culture, again, it, it doesn't matter where we're talking about. We can apply this standard anywhere. It just matters what standard we want to apply. Culture is to help us execute the behaviors required to produce the results that we want. It's culture's job to make execution better. It's not culture's job to make sure everybody feels good. Huge difference. You talked about comfort, right? What happens if we make a culture where everybody has to be, I'm going to make sure you're not uncomfortable at all. What happens, right? Like, next thing you know, if i got to make sure you're never uncomfortable, that means I can't tell you the truth. truth. And you can't tell me the... Because you telling me the truth might make me a little uncomfortable. The second we can't tell each other the truth, our culture is hurting us, not helping us. A culture... And how about this? Not just a culture where we can't tell the truth, but in an environment where people can't tell the truth, if you feel compelled to tell the truth... You want to tell the truth, but you're what? Scared. You're scared. And when people are operating out of fear, what kind of culture do you have? One that doesn't work. The second you have a culture where people are afraid to speak up, we have a culture of fear, and we have a problem. That makes sense? Now, what that means is this. Don't confuse a culture of fear with a culture where nobody can feel uncomfortable. And I think this is where we've messed this up. A culture that is going to achieve at a high level, it has to make you uncomfortable. Like, it has to. Otherwise, our culture is gravitating towards the middle. And I put this up. A culture where nobody feels uncomfortable is a culture that sits right in the middle, where we get to hide. The top end is super uncomfortable. Thanks for watching this video. Remember to subscribe and click the bell for notifications so you don't ever miss a post.